Yo, what's going on you guys? It's me Kale back with another video. And today we're gonna be doing some kind of hide and seek thing. So if you guys have watched like Mr. Beast, you'll know what I'm about to do. He's done those videos with like the last person to get found wins some certain amount of money. Obviously I'm not as rich as Mr. Beast, so I can't like do money like that. I'm gonna be doing something similar though, and I'm gonna do the last person that I find inside of Wizard City wins a 1250 crowns code. So yeah, I have a total of six people inside of my Discord server that are currently hiding inside of Wizard City right now. I told them all to hide inside the ghoul realm and I told them all to play as their pet so it's harder for me to find them and yeah they can literally be anywhere inside of wizard city i'll put up the rules on the screen right now they're not that complicated just like no glitch spots like no catacombs no dark boar and no crab alley pretty much but yeah pretty much i'm just gonna go and find them and the last person that i find wins the 1250 crowns so yeah rules aren't that complicated first we have to look for them in their pets and if it becomes too hard from looking for their pets then i'm gonna tell them to switch back to their characters so i'm gonna tell them that i'm gonna start searching right now and then we're gonna start searching wizard city Alright boys, so we're already inside of Wizard City, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be putting on my mount so that it's way easier for me like to move around. That mount's actually not that good, because I can't really see much. It has like a weird glare. The tricycle is probably the best, so we'll just use that. Alright, so we're just gonna search around Wizard City. I don't really know where to look. They could be playing as their pets right now, so like, they could literally be anywhere. I don't know if you can get in behind there if you're playing as your pet. Let me try. Because that would be kind of broken, actually. Okay, no, you can't. You can only go to, like, the normal places, even if you're playing as your pet. We're going to come and see if there's anybody over here. That would be kind of interesting. Wait, should I put on name tags? Honestly, that would be kind of better for me. I might do that. Actually, I mean, honestly, if I keep them off, though, then it's probably more legit. Wait, who the fuck is... Okay, no, I think that's just... I think that's an NPC. I thought that was actually somebody, but do I have name tags on? I don't. I'm gonna keep it that way, because then it's definitely harder for me to find them, and I don't want this to be easy. I want to be here for a bit. I'm just gonna search behind all of these tents and see if there's anybody just, like, snaking around here. Are these actual people? I've never seen these NPCs. What do they even do? Like, what? I've literally never seen them. We're searching around here, too. It looks like there's nobody, though. Hold up, wait, can you go in between here? You can. Imagine if someone was hiding here, I almost probably would have just passed that. Okay, so let's just keep searching around here, I guess. We're gonna go in there. We're gonna go in that place after, though. We're gonna search around here first. It doesn't seem like there's anybody just randomly hiding in here. I told them they couldn't go inside of catacombs. That was inside the rules. Because honestly, if I put in, like, catacombs, Darkmoor, and Crab Alley, that would be, like, way too much stuff that I have to search. So we're gonna just leave those out. I mean, I don't see anybody. So I think we're in the clear here. We're gonna go into this dragon's den thing. I don't think anybody's gonna be in there because it's kind of like an obvious hiding spot, you know? If there's anybody in here, that's kind of sad. Alright, it doesn't look like it. There could still be somebody hiding like as their pet kind of secretly, but it doesn't look like it. See, so yeah, I think we're in the clear over here, so I'm gonna rule out Golem Court, and we're gonna go back to the commons. I'm gonna finish searching out the commons, and if I do find someone, I'll definitely come back. And now I'm inside the library, because I searched, like, all of the commons. That guy's not playing either, I don't think. No, that's not one of the pictures I got. But there is this place over here. I'm gonna search that last after I'm done searching, like, all of the library, though, because someone could be hiding inside those, like, uh, those hallways. Alright, I feel like there's a good chance that there's maybe one person inside of here. I mean, I don't really know, but I feel like there would be someone in here. It's kind of a good spot to hide. Like, imagine if I searched the library last, or I just forgot about this place completely. So, we're gonna search these hallways. It doesn't look like there's anybody in that one. They could've went to the last one. We're gonna do the last one first, I guess. So, there's nobody just, like, along this little hallway. Let's check this last one. It doesn't look like it. Yeah, I guess there isn't anybody in here. Let's search this, like, long hallway, the middle one first, before we actually leave. But no, I don't think there's anybody in here. All right, we're gonna search the pet pavilion. I feel like there's not gonna be anybody in here, but I just wanna make sure first, before we actually, like, move on. I didn't see anybody outside. I'm gonna go on the inside. Odds of someone hiding on the inside are pretty low, though, because there's, like, literally nowhere to hide. Yeah, I don't think there's anybody in here. There is these little shops, though, so I'm gonna search that before I leave. Nobody in here, and I guess there's nobody in here. Okay, now we can either search Unicorn Way, or we can go into, like, the Death School place. Or we could do Ravenwood. Should we do Ravenwood first? Honestly, the Death School place is, like, the smallest spot, so I think I'm gonna do that first. Nah, this isn't somebody hiding, that's just someone actually doing quests, I think. So let's just search around here, I guess. We're going around the Mortis Tree. I don't think there's anybody out here. I could be wrong, though. There could be someone just, like, snaking me with their little death pet or something. 
but no i don't think so it doesn't seem like it i think we're in the clear out here we could go and check inside of the death school and then also the death tower the death tower maybe inside of ravenwood there's a bunch of people in the side of like the towers that would actually be a smart hiding spot so you never know let's search all around here though before we leave and then we're also going to search like the death school place um it doesn't look like it Wizard City is actually so big though. I've only done like the small places to start off with though. It has been a bit, but like honestly, we should be able to find some people pretty soon. Okay, we're inside the death school place now. Um, we're with Dwargan. Let's see, there's nobody behind the counter. There's nobody at the book, I don't think. Let's check behind it first. Because there could be like some small pets. And then I don't think there's anybody over here. Can you even get behind there? I don't think so. And then inside of here you can't. And then over there, nah, there's nobody right i think we're in the clear over here too all right i'm done searching everything carefully i'm going in the ravenwood i'm just searching everything super fast and we're gonna try and find as many people as i can and then we'll go back and we'll go in like search everything really like carefully i guess we could say what are these people doing what the fuck why is there just a group of people inside of the ghoul realm that's so weird i'm gonna check all of the school houses first and if i do find someone then i will come back yo no joke there's actually way too many places to hide in here though it's actually so hard to find people boys i'm putting on name tags i do not care if there's someone in here we're gonna see them i don't even care should i i'm gonna turn them on for a bit if i do find someone way too easily with them on then i will turn them off for like the other people but honestly i just want to be able to find someone plus i've been searching for like straight up 20 minutes already and i haven't even got through like half of the wizard city yet we're gonna search bartleby 2 before we leave but it doesn't look like there's anybody here all right boys we're heading to the major areas now we're going in the unicorn way first but actually we're gonna search the arena really quick it does not look like there's anybody in here though i'm pretty sure this would be a pretty bad spot to hide anyways i got someone else inside my discord that's gonna help me search now so they're logging in right now and then once they're logged in they're gonna add me and we're gonna search together they're probably gonna search somewhere different from where i am but if they do find someone they're probably gonna tell me the port so yeah we're gonna keep searching inside unicorn way though and there's nobody in this maze place all right boys we got cameron on our side now he's gonna look for people too he is the person from my discord server so yeah hopefully we can find some people now but yeah i'm gonna search this area now because i have not gone anywhere past the shopping district and this is where the main area is like this is where all of the hiding spots are past the shopping district so hopefully we can actually find some people now i really do not want to check every single shop do i have to Honestly, that'd be such a bad spot too, because there's literally nowhere to hide inside of there. You just go in there and then just stay there. If they're hiding inside one of these shops, I'm not checking them. They just win, because honestly, checking every single shop is just annoying. All right, we're checking Colossus Boulevard now. This is like one of the bigger areas, so hopefully there is someone just hiding in here. I feel like if there is someone in here, they're probably hiding like near the end of Colossus Boulevard, because that's where everything kind of gets complicated. So yeah, I'm not going to use the teleporters, because if they are along like these streets in between, between the teleporters then that won't be good yo wait there's somebody there yeah you can see their name tag bro i literally wouldn't be able to see that i actually wouldn't have been able to see that if i didn't have name tags on bro what the fuck who is this red ghost i have to check now oh i can just check their name okay it's brandon pants so yeah he's out now so we only have five people left to find bro i'm telling you if i did not have name tags on that would have been impossible there's way too much space inside of here for me not to have name tags on i definitely need to keep my name tags on i'm at another one of these like side places and you can't go inside of it that is so weird why is that one the only one that you could go inside of okay i made it to the end of colossus boulevard so we'll see if there's anybody like inside of here i guess i don't think there is because i feel like this would be too obvious just hiding right at the end of colossus boulevard i did tell the other person searching with me to start in old town and he is looking in here now so he's going into the bazaar um i think i'll just search around side of like the not the buildings inside of old town i'm gonna look on the outside i guess I just want to see if I can find someone on the outside first. There isn't really any more places that you can go in, though. I think... Oh, well, actually, we can search over around here, though. There might be someone around here. Actually, no, I think we're good. That would be too obvious, right? That would be definitely too obvious. It didn't look like there was anybody inside of Old Town, so now we're going to search Triton Avenue. Triton Avenue is so much different from when I actually first started playing the game. Like, they updated it so much. Ooh, the person in my Discord found someone. Okay, we're going to port to him. I'm going to... I can't even mark my location. Actually, I'm going to switch out my gear, and we're going to port to him. Um, 
So yeah, now I have my uh, my mana back. What am I saying? I'm going to mark here because we're going to come back and we're going to port to him. Are we reported to him? So he looks like he was just hiding right at the start of Cyclops. I didn't even enter Cyclops yet. So honestly, I would have probably found him. But yeah, that means there's four people left. So let's just keep searching. One of the people actually had to get off. So now we only have to search for three more people, which means it's going to be easier for me, I guess. But yeah, I'm going to go back to Triton Avenue. Yo, okay, we got another one. We got this guy. Wait, who is this? We got the, the hamster. Let's see who this is. Wait, we can't even click on the... Their, their thing okay there we go liam all right boys that means there's only two people left wait cameron said he found someone too i'm gonna port to him wait what the fuck that means there's only one person left if cameron actually found somebody that means there's only one left so that means whoever's left one i don't know who it is though because i don't really remember wait where he said he found wolf so where was wolf hiding um I don't even know because I wasn't here, but it looks like it was somewhere inside of Cyclops. Wait, the last person is Parker, and he said he's in Colossus, and I was already in there. There's no way I completely missed him. I have to go back now. I just remembered. I didn't check anywhere down here. Do you think he's in here? Imagine if he's inside this spell place. Okay, wait, he's not. Okay, okay, good, good, good. I was gonna be kind of mad at myself if I didn't check there, and there's actually somebody there. Right when I went in here, he said he lost connection, and he actually was hiding in here. I'm actually so mad at myself that I forgot to check here. That is so unlucky for the person that I found, because they were technically the last person if I did actually check here when I was checking Colossus. That is actually so unlucky. I'm so mad at myself for forgetting this spot. But yeah, that means Samuel won the Crowns Co, so I'm gonna send it to him. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the video off here. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was pretty fun. I'm I'm thinking about doing this for like every single world so like crocotopia would be next so let me know if you guys are interested in that and also if you guys want to join next time then make sure to join my discord server that'll be the top link in the description if you guys enjoyed then make sure to leave a like and also subscribe but yeah i'll see you guys next time